Today, I want to tell you about a really handy device, the Check Edge Ruler Stop. What is a ruler stop? It is a very simple device that takes any size ruler and you can slide it in there, lock it down with the knob, and now you've got a repeatable uh, measurable distance from the edge of the stop to the end of your ruler. So you could take that and use it in multiple places or save it throughout your project. The check edge ruler stop is made in the US and precision ground non-marring surfaces. The adjustable jaw here easily moves in and out using this knurled brass knob. When I first opened the check edge ruler stop, I noticed how beautiful it was. It's got a nice weight to it, really nice surfaces and very smooth action uh, turning the knob. I've got some really nice tools in my shop and this is gonna fit right in. One of the main purposes of a ruler stop is to hold an exact measurement off the edge of a board. So here I'll slide in this little six inch ruler and we'll go say two and a quarter and just tighten it right down there, nice and tight so my ruler doesn't move. And I can grab marking and come from the edge of my board, simply slide right along, and bam, I've got a nice repeatable measurement. Now I can leave it in here, I can mark multiple pieces at that same measurement. What I love about this stop is the fact that you can hold a variety of things in the jaws. From a simple six inch ruler, just cinch it up, little twist of the knob to tighten it, and that ruler isn't going anywhere. You can slide that out and put in a 12 inch ruler. Just open it up a little wider, get the ruler in there, cinch it up, good to go. Not only can it hold rulers, but you can also hold story sticks. Here's just a simple piece of wood. Again, a few turns of the knob, easily moves that jaw in down to the width of my stick here. Tighten it up and I can use any kind of distance here and I've got that repeatable measurement here with the story stick. You can see how beneficial the ruler stop is by using your six inch ruler or any size ruler for quickly marking off some distances. But you can also use it with a story stick for marking off uh, multiple pieces with the same distance. You may not care exactly what that distance is. Here say I wanted to put a shelf up a certain distance from the bottom of this board. And obviously I want that to match on both sides of my cases. Well I can just take a scrap stick here and throw the ruler stop on it. Tighten the knob and this stick isn't going anywhere. Register it against the bottom, and now I can just go ahead and mark where my shelf is gonna be. I can take it to my other side of my case and mark the exact same distance. How about a depth gauge? Here I've got quarter inch dowel, and I'll just lay the ruler stop along my board, tighten it down on this dowel, which is registered here on my bench, and there you go. I've got that distance locked in. Or of course, another way of looking at a depth gauge is down in a hole. I can drop this down till it bottoms out, then go ahead and tighten it up. And now I know how deep that hole is. So there are just a few uses for the check edge ruler stop. Now I carry my six inch ruler with me all around the shop. And the check edge ruler stop is a great accessory, not only for this ruler, but other rulers in my shop. And since I can fit it in my pocket, I've always got it with me. <music>